good morning guys welcome to today's vlog now that i'm a bit more settled in i'm getting into the habit of vlogging more picking up my vlogging camera more it is currently 9 30 in the morning i slept in a little more than i usually do i usually wake up around 7 or 8 the latest i guess i needed the rest i'm taking you guys with me to the city so we are gonna get ready right now hopefully get some coffee because even though i slept really well i still need a little extra boost let's get ready let's put on some music wash our face take a quick shower do a light makeup and get ready for today today's wednesday let's go first things first let's wash our face time for a quick shower i'm not washing my hair i took a shower last night but i like to take a shower in the morning as well i like to take two showers especially in the summer got our slippers towel and our robe let's get in Time for skincare. You guys saw that I washed my face with the Biosance Squalane Amino Aloe Gentle Cleanser. I like to wash my face outside of the shower. I don't know if you guys are like that. I don't know why, but it's just been the first thing that I do. This is a newer product from Biosance. I don't know if you guys saw me venting on Instagram stories about my skin going through it. My skin said, no ma'am. Like it was just breakout after breakout after breakout. Honestly, it was getting to me. I had clusters of texture and acne and just a bunch of whiteheads and I just was so confused. So I said, you know what? Let me just stop everything. The opportunity to work with Biosance came up and I said, you know what? Let me try it. My skin was just so textured and now <laughs> baby texture wear. Now we are doing so much better. So this portion of today's video is in collaboration with Biosense. What a difference this has made switching over to a clean beauty brand. I feel like you guys could even notice that my skin is doing a lot better. I still have some trouble spots. I still have a little bit of texture, but it's gotten so, so much better. So I've been washing my face with the Biosense Squalane and Amino Aloe Gentle Cleanser. I always want to say Squalane, but it's Squalane. I love that this cleanser has aloe because it cleanses your face without over drying it and i love that it foams up it just feels like a spa moment every single morning i'm not gonna lie to you guys i would skip washing my face in the mornings like i would only wash my face at night and doing it twice a day has made such a difference my skin just feels so much cleaner so you mix a small amount of this with some warm water on your hand it lathers up so nicely and you honestly feel like you are at a spa when you're in your own bathroom which i love so my whole regimen right now is biosans i feel like that works best for me when I stick to one brand for my regimen and so far so great. I then go in with some toner. I love toner. This is the Biosense Squalane and BHA Pore Minimizing Toner. This toner targets larger pores so it visibly tightens larger pores. I don't really use pore filling primers anymore. I'd rather just focus on my skincare and if you've never used a BHA toner, I'm telling you life changing. The first time you use it, you're literally going to see a huge difference. Especially if you use it overnight, you wake up and you're like why haven't i been using this forever and ever you can apply your toner with your hands but i like to put some on a cotton pad the toner will definitely check you because even if you washed your face there's still some lingering nasties. Did you get your hairline though? Pulled up the website so I can give you guys the 411. This product is vegan, gluten-free, cruelty-free, and comes in recyclable packaging. The packaging is also gorgeous. Like it looks so pretty in your bathroom, on your vanity. It's giving very much spa. And it says the secret to this formula is raw white willow bark, a powerful source of natural BHAs with multiple benefits. Skin calming, dead skin dissolving, texture smoothing, blended with hydrating squalane 
clean. It's going to exfoliate excess oil, dirt, and debris away, but it's also going to quench your skin. It's made to balance the oiliest of oily skin types without dehydrating the driest and leave skin feeling refreshed and ready for the rest of your routine. It's very refreshing, especially in the summer, and I love that anyone can use this. Like, if you have super duper dry skin, it's going to help balance you, or if you have super oily skin, it's also going to help balance you, or if you have perfect skin, kudos to you. You can also use this, and it's not going to irritate you. It's nice. It's very nice. Next, we moisturize. So I'm using the Biosans Squalane and Omega Repair Cream. So this is a hydrating moisturizer rich in lipids and ceramides that visibly plump and improve the appearance of fine lines without leaving a greasy afterfeel. So this is for all skin types, normal, dry, combination, and oily. And if you have skin concerns of fine lines and wrinkles, dryness, and loss of firmness and elasticity, this is for you. So it has omega fatty acids, hyaluronic acid, and acai berry. Again, vegan, cruelty-free, gluten free recyclable packaging so i went with this cream because of those ceramides the lipids the fatty acids i want to feel plump i will tell you guys there is a little bit of an odd scent to it but it doesn't linger like you don't smell it throughout the day you just smell it when you're applying it goes away in minutes if not seconds the glow that you get the feel, the bouncy skin, so worth it. I know you see the glow, it is serious. You guys know I suffer with sensitivities and allergies to products. I get contact dermatitis like this very quickly with skincare, makeup, literally anything will just break me out in a ton of little bumps. It almost looks like a rash on my skin. I don't know if you guys have ever suffered with that, but it is the most annoying thing to deal with because it's not acne, so you can't treat it with acne products and you can't really fix it with facials. It's literally just like an allergy. It's the sensitivity the only way to fix it is to use products that aren't going to aggravate your skin or give you a flare-up or give you an allergy or a rash so far so great these products have been so good to me so i'm going to finish off my skincare with some eye cream the biosans squalane and marine algae eye cream this eye cream visibly firms and instantly smooths we are doing light makeup today and i used to only use eye cream at night but 30 is around the corner i'll be 29 this year i feel like the more i say it the more i have to accept it so i keep repeating myself but i'll be 29 November 1st. We don't need premature wrinkles from the sun because we all know I love the sun. I kid you not, after one use, helped the eczema on my eyelids tremendously. So I used to waking up with my eyelids crusty, but we're not seeing crusty anymore. We have a nice rich eye cream and some eye creams give me milia. I'm telling you, I'm like the perfect candidate to test out a clean beauty brand because I am extremely sensitive. So some eye creams, they're too moisturizing or they have something in it. It almost looks like a pimple, but it's not. It's like oil trapped in your skin. I don't know if you guys have ever gotten those bumps. I've gotten them on my eyelid. I'll get one after applying an eye cream once. So I usually wake up and I'll know if an eye cream worked for me or not because my skin reacts very quickly it does have a little bit of a tint it's not like those eye creams that are tinted that don't work for all skin types like this is like a barely there for me really it just gives you more of like a glow but if you're struggling with dark circles or dry under eyes or you're getting like really big creases under your eye especially when you're doing your makeup like that's when you really know you need to get a new eye cream definitely check this one out like i'm telling you guys you can see the glow for yourself let me show you yes 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 there's no better feeling than to glow after your skincare. And if you're sensitive like me to not only glow after your skincare, but not break out or not get irritated by your skincare. So far, so great. I mean, you guys can see the glow. You guys can see that my skin is doing a lot better. I mean, I don't know if you guys noticed that I was breaking out, but I definitely talked about it on Instagram. I'm telling you guys, I was desperate. I wanted to go into all of my drawers and throw everything out because I was so frustrated. It's not easy dealing with so many allergies, especially in this field and with with what I do. I'm honestly so happy. I'm feeling way more confident when I do my makeup because I just have way less texture. My skin is glowy. It's feeling plump, hydrated, and it just looks so much better with and without makeup. Like the true test though is when you apply your makeup and you hit that certain lighting, like that texture was really getting to me. Of course, all products will be listed down below. Thank you to Biosans for partnering with me. Honestly, chef's kiss. So let's do our makeup. I'm gonna try no promises to keep it very minimal because it's going to be a hot day and I'm going to be walking around the city. I do want to put on some makeup because I think I want to take some pictures while I'm in Manhattan. Just a light beat, but no promises. Connected to roses I found. Thank you. So I'm telling nobody I must stick with you forever. I must stick with you
pumpkin cold foam is back 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 what <sighs> heaven oh my god it tastes like okay then see ice chai tea latte add pumpkin cold foam and add an extra shot of espresso for today let's do Louis Vuitton over the Epsom Outfit of the day We got clear heels by shoots My favorite heels I repurchased them twice and I'm probably gonna get them one more time to get a fresh pair But they're super comfortable. They go with everything ignore this mark on my leg I don't know what happened in DR, but I think it's a mosquito bite gone wrong I just have on some biker shorts because this is supposed to be a dress, but it's way too short So this is from Shein. I'm wearing it as a top and then I have a lace bra peeking through just because the top is so open. For the bag, we're rocking the Celine. And that's the outfit. And we are ready to go. We're heading to the city. Hopefully grab some lunch. Got an errand to do. In case you're wondering what's on my lips, it's MAC Yash Lipstick with Makeup Forever Anywhere Caffeine Lip Liner and a little bit of myth in the center. Lashes are La Shaila. Isla lashes the foundation is the Lancome one that I've been reading about but as you can see the skin is just Sitting I'm a little tan for this foundation right now, but I'm gonna fix that right now I'm gonna blend it a little bit more perfect day. I even got my pumpkin cold foam So good remember when I came off the menu I was like I'm gonna have one every single day when it comes back It's just so freaking good Alright, bye. <laughs> Fíjate por dentro di quién es el rico y quién es el pobre. Cuerpo en polvo, ya no va a haber nada que a mí me haga falta ni que a ti te sobre. Pero que pula, no. Esa me dice mi destino está escrito. Que soy de los maduros, soy real, no es un mito. Si sobra el papel, cosas de familia no van a entender. También hay secretos, no puedo contarlo. Pero si me llamas, te So 
we got our chicken satay and I have a lychee martini. Bon appetit! Whenever I go to like a Thai restaurant, I always ask for peanut sauce on the side. I put Charlene onto that when she used to live in Queens. We used to go every week. That's all. With the spring rolls. Oh my god. Chicken lo mein, shrimp fried rice. 